Hello, everyone, and welcome to another episode of Cuddy Eats. Today, I'm going to be eating, for you, the Wisconsin Pub Burger from Culver's. Now, I'm excited about this one because I personally have never been to Culver's. It's not ever been something that I said, hey, guys, let's go out and go get Culver's. Um, when I'm stopping for food, it's, it's not a, a place that I see and go, ooh, let's stop here. Uh, it's never really been on my radar, and I'm hoping that this limited edition item uh, will change that. So I went ahead and got us a combo so we can see what's up. That means it comes with a nice bag of fries. These look very good. They're crinkly, and we'll see how they taste. Mmm. Very good. Um, see the nice and thick crinkly fries. Very excited about that. I got the blue cheese sauce to go with it. Um, I'm a big fan of blue cheese. If you wanted to get ketchup or honey mustard or something, um, that's your own prerogative. Uh, as far as sauces like that go, unless I'm rating a sauce, I'm going to really leave it up to you guys to decide which you feel like having at the time. And then, here's the burger. It comes in a little box. Uh, it looks like it's made out of recycled paper. I see that right on the back. That's good. I really appreciate that. I'm big on the environment. We open it up. It looks very nice. Um, it's got a little fold on it, but if we take that out and go ahead and look at that, that actually looks really good. If you look at those patties, they're not big old thick patties, but they are those nice, thin little styled patties that I think are going to be very good. Uh, it looks like there's just some melted cheese on the top. Um, maybe it looks like some Swiss in the middle. Um, American on the bottom, and it looks like it might be cheddar on the top. So that's actually going to be pretty fun to dig into. So I'm excited to see how this tastes. Mmm. And I think that the double patties um, go very well with that cheese um, all throughout. Mmm. Mmm. For only waiting maybe three minutes in the in the after I had ordered, I would say this is very good. Mm. This is a very good surprise. Um, you can see how the fries taste the blue cheese. Mm. And that's a pretty good sauce as well. Mm. Fries themselves are very good. Um, very thick, nice and crispy. Let's try and get you a few good examples of that. You can see they—I mean—they're very crinkly. They're not the thin McDonald's style or the potato wedge style. They are the thick cut, crinkly, very similar to um, perhaps the Orida ones that you could get at the store. I am washing this down with the Pepsi. They are um, part of the Pepsi, it seems. They have Pepsi products. Uh, not everyone prefers Pepsi or even accepts Pepsi as a substitute, so get what you want. I think it goes very well with this. Mm. Something about the three different cheeses melting together um, in each bite, combined with the sort of thinner patties, really does give this a nice taste. Looks like there might be a bit of mayonnaise on there too. Interesting that they have the mayonnaise on the bottom bun. The bun itself is very good too. Very light. Um, not too thin. It's not too much to where you're, you know, almost forcing down a, a, a throat full of bread each bite. But enough to hold the sandwich together.
And they really do. You know, when I saw this little uh, bag, I was a little worried that I wouldn't be getting too many fries. But they really did jam-pack them down in here. There's plenty. And just this, just this bag. And, uh, you know, this combo right at about $10. Um, Culver's seems to be a bit more expensive than, say, McDonald's for a combo. Um, but I think you do pay for what you get. Oh, okay, nothing too much spilled. And I would say, for a fast food burger um, of this quality, I'm not surprised to see it a little bit higher up. It's not your quick sitting under the heat lamp for, you know, 15, 20 minute style burger. That you can just pick up and go. But I think it tastes good for what it is, and it, it seems fairly reasonably priced. Mm. This is getting me very full. Um, And with that one, I would definitely recommend that. Um, it is a limited time item. I don't know how it compares to sort of their other burgers, but as far as this burger goes, I would definitely give Culver's the thumbs up. I'm very happy with my order. Uh, it, was, it was quick. Uh, it really was everything that I, I was looking for, and I'm happy with it. So I would definitely be going back again. Uh, that's the end of this Cutty Eats. Please, everyone, like and smash that subscribe button. Uh, follow me on social media. Uh, donate on Patreon if you feel generous. And I hope to see you guys next time.